All right, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can add a confidential or draft watermark to your document very quickly in Google Docs. So let's get into it. All right, the first thing you need to do is go to the insert menu and then select watermark. A new menu will appear on the right hand side of the screen. You can select to insert an image as a watermark or you can also select text. I'm going to just select text, but later I'm going to explain how to insert an image as a watermark in your document. Let's put something here as the watermark. I want to write a state of the document, which is draft. You can also select other text. It's totally up to you, but I recommend to keep everything simple and concise. You can change the font type to whatever font type available in your document. And then you can change the transparency level, you can change the style, the placement, you can put it in front or behind the text. And also there is an option to change the orientation of the watermark. And when you're done, you can just click this done button. And this watermark will be implemented to all pages in your document. But let's move on to the image watermark. I'm going to remove this watermark for now. Let's go back to image. Select image. You can select the image watermark from various sources, but in this example, I'm going to be using photo from my Google Photos account. I highly recommend to use something like logo or you might want to use a stamp from your company. And for the sake of tutorial, I'm going to just using some random picture here. But of course, this is not the best way to use watermark. But then again, this is just for education purposes. So I'm going to select this picture. And there you go, you can tell that there is an image behind the text of this page. But let's change something like the scale, maybe I'm going to turn it to 200. Okay, that looks awful, but that's alright. You can also enable or disable the faded option. This will give or remove the transparency effect of the document. I think it's better to keep it on. And then click done when you are finished. So that's essentially how you can add watermark to your Google Docs document. I hope you find this video helpful and I'll see you on the next video.